Hi everyone, I'm Amy. Today's workout is going to be an ab workout that is going to strengthen our core and also challenge our balance using a stability ball. We're gonna start sitting on the stability ball. We will go on to plank with our hands and our elbows. So I'm going to use my railing to push the ball up against the railing. So you wanna maybe make sure that you're close to a wall. And then we'll go on to the mat and do some stuff on our backs using the stability ball. Okay, let's get started. Okay guys, we're gonna start with both feet on the mat, arms up, starting with keeping the right foot first down on the mat. We're gonna do alternate knee ups as we bring the elbows down, flexing our feet, focusing on our core. Please do your best to not round your spine. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is sit up really, really stay straight, focus on the core as you raise up alternating knees. Really engage in your core. Focus also on your balance. So right now, I am looking at something in my room as a focal point, really engaging in my midsection. We're gonna do 20 more from here. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Hands behind your head. Right elbow to right knee keeping the chest up and open, alternating. Really focusing on midsection and also obliques. From here, 20 more. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. 20. Wow, okay. We're going to lay down on the ball. Actually, my shoulder blades are barely resting on the ball. So we're gonna have the shoulder blades on the ball in the next move, but on this move, we're just gonna have our feet evenly put onto the mat. You can also do this workout without shoes. Have your elbows not crazy wide, but somewhere in between, and we are going to isometric crunches up, really, really supporting the neck and the core, really, really focusing on engaging in the core. We're gonna do 30 lifts from here. So this is one and two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, 20, you should really be feeling this one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 30, nice. Now we're gonna drop down and have our shoulder blades on the mat, have our feet on tippy toe, keeping our hips up. From here, we're gonna do more of a chin to chest crunch, so it's here, but we're on tippy toe, keeping our hips up. We're gonna do 30 crunches here, trying to be as still as a statue with the rest of your body besides the, the part of your body which is up or that's working. So this is five, engaging in the core, six, 
seven, eight, nine, ten, one. Feeling my hamstrings getting fired up too. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, ten more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty. Drop your heels. Right elbow is going to direct over towards your left knee as your left arm is nice and tight and straight. We are focusing on left oblique. We're gonna do a little bit faster, but we are gonna do some isometric crunches, pulsing it pretty quickly for 40, okay? I will count out every one. Keep this arm. Actually, let's make a fist with our right or our left hand. And really put tightness into that left arm. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty, switch, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty, stay with it, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, thirty, last ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty. Right down the waist, obliques. Nice work. Okay, here we go. Now is where you're gonna wanna put your ball up against a wall, something sturdy. And if you um don't want to put it up against a wall or something sturdy, it will make it more challenging. So challenge yourself if you want to. I'm gonna actually put mine up against my railing. We're gonna start with elbow plank. And we're going to do opposite knee to stability ball touches. And if you can't touch the ball, it is okay. You want your neck neutral. So it's going to look like this. Do your best to try to get the knee to the stability ball. Core is engaged. From here, 20 more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine and 20 nice so you obviously got some upper body work on that move now we're going to go into hands make sure that your wrists are okay if you have any pain just drop down to elbows and we'll just do the same exercise that we just did again did the last time i'm going to go into hand plank and you please just really really listen to your wrist because you can if it, there's any pain, don't do it. Just go drop down to elbows. So from here, we're gonna do a 20 second hold, really engaging in the core. I will count out every second. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
nine, 20, 20 touches. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 20. Drop down, nice work. Okay, we're gonna put the ball in between our legs. We're gonna leave our head actually down on the mat for this move. So hold the ball, really squeeze it in between your legs. Have a slight bend with both of your knees, but keeping the ball tight, okay? Head stays down, hands pushing down into the mat. And all we're gonna do here is a leg lifts with the stability ball in between our legs. So I'm actually gonna put my hands underneath my bum for a little bit extra support. From here, let's do 15. This is one, pushing the spine down into the mat. Two, it's great work for the hip flexors. Three, four, five, six, tight core, seven, eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, 15, nice. Okay, ball on your mat. We're just going to bend our knees. Whew. Okay, have your elbows wide on this and we're not going to do chin to chest. We're just going to go up have your head going straight up toward your ceiling, your sky, whatever you're working with. Keep your feet really, really flexed, pushing your calves down into the ball. We're gonna do 40 crunches up. One, two, you should, this should, you should really feel this more in your upper core. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 20, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 30, push that spine down, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 40. Okay, the head stays down on the mat on this entire move. Ball is gonna be above your head. You're going to put it in between your legs, arms, and then you grab it, and then you come together, have your heels hovering the mat or have them touch the mat, whatever you prefer. Okay, 10 more. These take a little while. This is one. Also, please don't hold your breath. Two. Three. Four. Oh, five, six, seven, three more. Stay with it. Be in tune with your form. Eight. nine and 10. Ooh, nice. Okay, ball above your head. 
You're going to lift just your left leg. We're gonna stay just on left leg, have your legs wide. We're gonna roll up with the ball and tap the ball with just our left toes for 15. Then we're gonna alternate, raising up one. Really feel this too. So you're not fully coming up, but you are coming up three. Keep the left leg tight as you lift it for five. Engaging the core, six. Seven. Eight. Nine. 10, five more, one, two, three, four, 15, other side, 15 more, one, two, three, Four. It's a great move. I'm really feeling even my arms firing up. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Five more. One. Two, three, four, four, <laughs> last one, 15, nice. Now we're gonna roll up. We're gonna actually gonna sit up. You're gonna start here, you're gonna roll up, keeping the arms long. We're gonna turn for 10 times, this is three. Keeping your back really straight up, four, five, six, Engage in the core. Seven, obliques. Eight, nine, 10. Rolling back. Four more rounds. One, sit up really tall. Two, watch the ball. Turn three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Three more rounds. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two more rounds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Last round, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Nice. Lay back on your mat. Have the ball. Your feet are um, pushing the ball in, keeping the legs tight. Wow, look at my legs quivering. Okay, left hand behind the head. Ra raising the right hand straight up for 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Switch. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. That was really hard. Wow. Comment below. Please let me know what you thought of that move. Yikes. Okay, one more move. We are going to have the left leg draping over the ball, Whew. squeezing the shoulder blades underneath, 
and doing a leg lift for six. One, balance, two, three, do your best to keep the hips up, four, five, six, switch feet, six more, one, this is a lot harder on this leg too, three, really good hamstring work too, four, five, and six. Also having a focal point on that move, very important. Nice work, 20 minutes. I'm sweaty. I feel really, I felt really, I feel like I was very challenged. Let me know what you thought. Also, my heart to your heart. Any request, let me know, and I will see you soon. Have a wonderful self-care day. Bye.